Good morning, Newman Smith. I'm Dr. Jimenez, the proud principal of Newman Smith High School, where our mission is to graduate all scholars to be college, career, or military ready without remediation. Well, happy Tuesday to all of the Trojans out in Trojan Nation. Big week this week. Uh, but before we get into our announcements, I'd like to read our SAT word of the day and our quote. So our quote for the day is by... Um, a person named Seneca the Elder, and the quote is, there's no delight in owning anything unshared. So sharing what you have brings great delight. Then our SAT word of the day is dubious, D-U-B-I-O-U-S. It means, it's an adjective, it means doubtful, questionable. The sentence is, the man's claims to the throne were dubious since no one knew where he came from. Hmm. Yeah, I can't go around claiming thrones, except for the principalship at Newman Smith. That's a great throne to sit on. All right, everybody. Um, we are starting today, today uh, with Black History Month. Black History Month is an annual celebration of achievements by African Americans and a time for recognizing their central role in U.S. history. Black History Month was the brainchild of noted historian Carter G. Woodson and other prominent African Americans. Since 1976, every U.S. president has officially designated the month of February as Black History Month. And why February, you may ask? Well, the second week of February was chosen to coincide with the birthdays of Abraham Lincoln and Frederick Douglass. Frederick Douglass has one of my favorite quotes, and I'll put that on the news tomorrow. This event inspired schools and communities nationwide to organize local celebrations, establish history clubs, and most performances and lectures, uh, and host performances and lectures. Other countries around the world, including Canada and the United Kingdom, also devote the month of February to celebrate Black history. So let's welcome over our BGU. We have with us today Kayla and Jordan, and they have our Black History Month announcement for today. Hey everybody, uh, I'm Kayla. And, I'm Jordan. Yeah. So today we're going to be talking about Lorraine uh, Hansberry. So she was the author of a play called A Raisin in the Sun that most people read in English class. And um, she was the first Black American and the youngest playwright to receive a New York Critics Circle Award for her work. And, we, and I'm going to be reading a quote that she wrote. And... It is, I wish to live, because life has within it, which is good, that which is beautiful, and that which is love. Therefore, since I have known all of these things, I have found them to be reason enough, and I wish to live. Moreover, because this is so, I wish others to live for generations and generations and generations and generations. Beautiful, just beautiful. Girls, thank you so much. We're excited. I know that we're doing the wall again this year. Yes. Is that going to be upstairs? Oh, uh, yeah. Yes. We can put you, it up yesterday. Can you tell our scholars a little bit about the wall? Yeah, so uh, we compiled a list of different uh, influential black figures. So we have entertainers and inventors, what politicians, authors, authors yeah, mm -hmm. a lot of people who are influential to the black culture. And we have a wall upstairs, so you guys can check out the facts and who they are. Wow, we're so proud of that, and so proud of all you guys have done and the good that you do in our community. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank Appreciate you. you being here. We'll close out in just a moment. All right, tomorrow is National Signing Day. We have three scholar athletes that are signing with their universities tomorrow. Now, we know there are more of you, and so we'll do another signing in the spring. And so we want to make sure that tomorrow morning at 730, everyone is welcome to be in the theater for our National Signing Day. All right, scholars. Well, don't forget, two things give you credit in school, attendance and a passing grade of 70. So be working on both of those as you are making your way through second semester. Uh, please keep an eye out for any inclement weather that could be coming this week. We will certainly keep you posted. We have coming up in March, actually into February, early March, course registration. You're going to want to select the courses that you're taking for next year right here at Newman Smith. And we are working on the guidebook. I know that Ms. Ketrasid is our digital graphics expert guru, and she's helping us get our guidebook together so we can get that printed and get it out to you. Well, I'm going to invite our scholars back over, and we're going to close out. We want you to know, scholars, that we love you. We think you're great. Remember, character counts, and make it a great day or not. The choice is yours.